All right, bless you, bro. Um, this is a healing and deliverance testimony uh, from our brother here. Uh, bro, you want to tell us your name and how long you've been Straight Away Truth Ministry and then uh, your testimony. Yes, sir. Brother Joshua, I've uh, been in Straight Away for about 11 years now. Yes, sir. Uh, and uh, your testimony. Yes, sir. All right, healing, deliverance, power of the Almighty. Hallelujah. Um. I guess I could give a quick backstory. Coming into the ministry, when I first got filled with the Holy Spirit, that's the first time I literally felt love. I got filled when I was about, I want to say about 12 years old. Came down to the feast, and uh, glory to the king, he filled me, with his spirit sealed me. And from then, literally, I you know, went back home, diving into the word, and I would see time after time how the Most High Eye has been rejected, despised, and truly how um, he's pretty much been forsaken since creation beginning of creation and it that's something that always had me in a place of truly just brokenness and contriteness so diving into the word all right i already had it in my sights to truly make it my aim to please god with everything within me as a child praise god you know coming into manhood and um so to fast forward into the healing deliverance and the power of the most high Reading that word, I would see and hear, or really see and read how fire would come down from heaven through the prophets, how, you know, like Peter who's walking by and you got people being healed by the shadow. I'm like, That's right. me being a child of the king as well, I know now I have the spirit of Yah inside of me that I, through, he can, through me, manifest that same power as long as I remain holy and submitted to him at his will. Mm -hmm. So I remember it was, uh, I forget which feast it was, I was probably about 14 years old mm -hmm. and, um, Shepherd, at the end of the service, he said, if you believe you have the power of y'all, uh, working in you, raise your hand. Raise my hand. Mm -hmm. And instantly after, a brother, Brother Ethan, he taps me on my shoulder. He's like, hey, bro, I got one leg shorter than the other. Mm. Please lay hands on me. Mm. So, oh, yeah. Come on with it. Mm -hmm. So, he comes sits next to me and said, you believe Jesus can heal you. And mind you, the beauty in it is being in my secret place and remaining rooted right here in my mind of the most high. I had no thoughts of doubt at all. Mm -hmm. straight faith of the most high mm -hmm. so said in the name of jesus i command this leg to grow you've seen the leg grow and yes I, it was instant my brother shot up started yelling hallelujah started glorifying the king i'm like Man, look at the almighty elohim of israel because it's truly mm -hmm. none like yah yes it's none like the most high so to have the opportunity and the privilege to be used as a vessel from my childhood up now i could I've, I've cultivated the childlike faith to the point that's what I move in now. Mm. So, yes. It's a beauty. It's an honor. It's a privilege. It's a joy oh, to make. His name is already great, but be a vessel yes. that his name can continue to be made great through. So, oh, it's all praise to the Most High. Yeah. All praise to the Most High. Yeah. So, Jesus Christ used you to do a miracle. Oh, yes. By his power. Mighty, the creator. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. King of glory. Yes, sir. Glory to the King. Bless you, bro. Bless you. Hallelujah. That's great.